بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ایوری ون ٹوڈے وی ول شو یو اباؤٹ ہاؤ ٹو یوز ٹائپ سی ایتھر نیٹ اڈاپٹر ون اینڈ از ٹائپ سی اینڈ دا ادر سائڈ از ایتھر نیٹ اوپن ایٹ اپ This is Ethernet LAN okay. Gigabit Ethernet And this side is the USB-C And the specification These are the specifications There are some more available in the market Which have VLAN also available You can configure the VLAN but in this one there is no VLAN configuration available but there are other models available in the market you can get it this one will support up to 1 gig so let's begin with this device first of all we'll connect with my mobile here I will connect one end with this device and the USB-C will go in my mobile and here we have to go connections settings more connection settings and where you will find ethernet we will configure the device before connecting this device we have to configure it otherwise you will not be able to configure the device with the IP addresses so you have to configure this if you have a static IP you can just configure it or if you want it to be DHCP you can keep it on DHCP mode and this one manual non we will configure auto configuration manual or non we will keep it on non and we will see we will turn on the ethernet and the other end of the cable I am going to connect it to the modem can see there are the lights green and orange it's up right now I will turn on my mobile off my mobile data tap to set up okay so here we go now it is connected and the lights are over here and we can see Ethernet is on and configuration is already on DHCP and now I can see the internet is working fine so with the DHCP it is taking the IP addresses from this modem and configuring it on my device automatically and if I want to make it static IPs then I can click here static and we'll put the IP addresses net mask and if we have a DNS we can configure the DNS and then you can ping this device we'll show you with my laptop or the Argus device how to connect it disconnect it right now from this modem and 
by the way we'll configure this card okay we'll go to the ethernet settings we'll make it in on static ip i will configure any IP. okay here we go i have already configured the ip over here ip address dot 2 over here 10 10 10 10 2 and gateway is 10 10 10 dot 1 so this mobile is dot 1 and my argus is dot 2 okay we'll start from here and we'll try to ping the mobile ip ping 10 dot 1 and on my mobile device we can go to the ethernet settings and configure device and the static ips i have configured 10 10 10 dot 1 on my mobile and dot 2 is my gateway that is my argus and we'll go back and here we will go to the ping tests ping tools and we'll go to the ping and i will change the ip now 10 dot 10 dot 10 dot 2 2 is my argus so we'll try to ping it yes i can reach the ips now and we'll check it in the argus so in argus also we can ping it okay i will try to disconnect it now and you can see it will stop i have disconnected the cables now and the ping has been stopped so this is how you can use your mobile devices mobile device with this uh, ethernet to usb c adapter and you can use it in customer sites mostly it is useful for the technicians for telecom technicians uh, for the isp technicians who visit the customer sites and most of the time they need to bring their laptops with them in most of the places so instead of bringing their laptops to test the ping, ping test and the speed test you can use the mobile device with this ethernet device so you don't have to bring a complete laptop with you for the testing we'll also show you the speed test through the modem if you are a technician and you do you need to test the speed okay we'll stop this ping test and we'll go to the ethernet again and the ethernet device before connecting it We'll remove it now and connect it and the ethernet option is available now now you will click it and we will go to the settings we will make it automatic on the dhcp we will save the settings and now we will connect it with the modem now the internet will be connected directly with the dhcp and you will see if yes the internet is working so we'll go to the speed test can see from mobile you can check the te speed test also just using your ethernet device so this thing is very useful for technicians so they don't have to carry a complete laptop with them and instead of that they can use this device and you can see the upload and download both of them are available you can take the screenshot and you can attach in your files 
and you can send it to your telecom department or the ISP as a result. That's all for now. Thank you very much.